Hi guys, in this YouTube video I will, I will talk you about OpenBSD strength. The main one is portability because OpenBSD runs on a lot of different hardware platforms for example Intel 32 and 64 bit, Dec Alpha system, Apple computers, PowerPC and Intel, and Sun Microsystem Workstation and HP Power Whisk 9000 systems. The OpenBSD team wants to support many different hardware architectures, but when a, when a hardware platform is to a or obsolete, they stop supporting it. For example, 68,000 Macintosh and Amiga system are not supported anymore because they are used by very few people. Another strength is power because OpenBSD will run on hardware that, I, that has been obsolete for a lot of time because that hardware was popular when the OpenBSD project started, for example, VATS and Alpha workstations. OpenBSD will make your system faster because it is focused on performance, since the main system is made to run on such different architectures. The third strength is documentation. OpenBSD thinks that the documentation is very important. Documentation errors are considered serious bugs because if the documentation is wrong, people can do mistakes and make their system dangerous or insecure. Another OpenBSD strength is that it is free, like the original BSD license, for, by anyone, for any purpose. You can also use it in your proprietary system without paying the developers. Because this is the BSD license, it doesn't require you to give, to give away the source code. If you want, you can do it, but you are not forced to do it. Actually, iOS and macOS are Unix systems that follow BSD license. This, because of this, Apple has been allowed to not share the source code. The original units like operating system that OpenBSD is derived from it contained many programs with proprietary licenses. These programs have been relicensed or replaced with free alternatives, and now OpenBSD has all free source code, not any proprietary source code. But if you want or if you need, you can load the proprietary firmware inside the system to make some devices such as graphics card or Wi-Fi card working well. The other strength is correctness. The, the OpenBSD developers write programs in a reliable and secure manner. It is very important to fix all the bugs. They follow unit standards such as posits. The code is audited for correctness. And anyone who tries to introduce incorrect code will be warned that OpenBSD project is not for him. And the biggest selling point is that OpenBSD wants to be the most secure operating system in the world. Maintaining that position requires effort. The OpenBSD developers every day they scan the, the source tree to search for troubles to fix the issue before people can use it for damage. 
This project takes advantage of the security features offered by hardware. For example, AMD 64-bit can mark a part of memory as executable or writable but not both, and OpenBSD supported this feature in 2003 when it was released. Another feature is integrated cryptography thanks to TPM for Sensor that is used to help signing cryptographic keys such as PGP keys or archive keys used in SSH connection.